Hey guys, it is Saturday, April 9th. I am one week out from my last competition and I woke up to this. Do you see this? Do you see this? It's April 9th and we got snow. Rex, isn't that just snow awful? Mm, he doesn't really care. But I have a crazy day ahead. I am teaching a cooking class up at the Le Creuset store in Monroe. It's like a half an hour away. I haven't gone shopping for it yet. So it's 6.50 now and I have to leave, go to the grocery store, and I'm making some white fish tacos. Sorry, I have like morning breath and, well not morning breath because I brush my teeth, but like morning throat. I slept in today, I slept like 11 hours. And yeah, so I'm gonna go shopping for that, go give that class, and then I have to get to the gym, and then I have a 2 p.m. like posing nutrition thing. Basically just a competition type class, and that usually goes a couple hours, so I'm leaving as soon as I get done doing this vlog spot. I can't, my brain, guys, one week out. As soon as I get done doing this clip, I'm packing up for the day, heading to the store, heading to class, heading to the gym, heading to class. And that's my day. But I thought I'd take you guys with me. So we're gonna do like a day in the life and a week out. And you get to see how many times I forget what I'm saying in this vlog. Guarantee you it'll be double digits. Keep track. Anybody who wants to comment down the below. Just make me feel great about myself. <laughs> as far as meals go, I have Turkey burgers, this is 99% lean turkey and cauliflower rice. My Trader Joe's finally got the frozen cauliflower rice back and that makes me very, very happy. Got to feed my doggies. Buzz is too lazy to get out of bed. Look at how spoiled he is. Buzzy, why are you so lazy? Come eat your breakfast. I made him get up. I'm such a mean mom. So I have my shoes for posing, a clean shirt for after my workout, my pre-workout. This is just beta alanine and L-carnitine because I'm cutting out like a lot of supplements right now being a week out. And then I have all my meals down there in my little black lunch box. So we are ready to go. Lululemon bags saved my life. They hold so much. They're fantastic. I just got off the highway and there were in a two mile span about eight accidents. Apparently nobody planned for this weather. None of the overpasses have been salted so they're all frozen solid and everything is ice. I don't know like how on earth that this got missed. We got a couple inches of snow, nothing crazy, but there literally were cars spun out everywhere, hitting the medians, like just totally crushed. So <laughs> welcome to Ohio in April, I guess. It's crazy. I'm really worried about it because I don't know if anybody's gonna be at this class if the weather is this shitty. Excuse my language, I never swear on my channel. If the weather is this crappy. Okay, ding, you can count that as one of my, I forgot what I was saying moments. But yeah, crazy, crazy. In two miles, at least eight accidents. Just a car spun out everywhere. That's what I get to deal with this morning, so yay. Happy April, happy spring. All right guys, it is now 10 to eight. I got my venti Starbucks because it's cold and coffee. It's just Pike's place black coffee really simple and I got all my stuff to make fish tacos I'm making white fish tacos on corn tortillas with mango and avocado 
so those should be delicious, but I won't know because I can't eat them being a week out. Um, but I got tilapia and I got salmon because some people really don't like salmon and some people really don't like whitefish. So I got a little bit of each so that they can try whichever one they want, so that should be fun. Um, I didn't want to go with tilapia, I wanted to get mahi, but the fish stand or like fish market part of the store wasn't even open yet, so I did just get whatever was out. So luckily they did have some fish out. So I'm gonna go head up there, it's about 20 minutes away, set up, give class, and I will show you guys what it looks like. It's a pretty cool setup. They really hooked me up when I go up there and do classes. They set everything up for me, and I use all their really cool, like say, cookware, which I am a huge fan of. So I'll give you guys a glimpse of that. So these are the outlets where I give the classes. I just got done teaching class. We had about 11 people. That's a smaller class. There's usually a few more, but it went really well. We made fish tacos and everyone seemed to really enjoy them. And it was a lot of fun. So yeah, I showed you guys the setup and what the tacos look like. And now I am heading to the gym. I have legs today, so that should be fun. I have one of my meals with me but we have a microwave at my gym, so I'm gonna go there and heat it up and eat it before I work out, get my workout in, and then I have to be somewhere at two. It is almost 11 now, so I'm gonna get a move on, and I'll talk to you guys later. It's now 1.30, I just got done with the gym. My competition class thing got canceled, so I'm gonna go home and let the boys out and eat some cauliflower and turkey, because I'm starving, and some oat bran. Today is the last day I'll be having oat bran. As of tomorrow, it's sweet potatoes from here on out. So, I mean, this isn't a full day of eating, but I just thought I'd throw that in there. But I did just get done training legs. I did back squats, front squats, leg press. Um, what else did I do? Hamstring stuff. And I had to do hit and 10 minutes of lifts after. I did like plyos for hit, like jumping squats, um, box jumps, stuff like that. So I'm exhausted and I'm hungry. But I think that's gonna wrap up this video since I'm not going to class. I'm probably just gonna go home and do some work. I have some signs and stuff to work on. And I hope you guys enjoyed this little mini day in the life. Even though it wasn't a full day, there's not much else to show you. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and I will see you guys on Monday or Tuesday whenever I get the video up for my last bikini update.